The goddess statues almost seem like they're leading me towards all of the, <laughs> all of the the bright roots, which is okay. I I'll gladly, I'll gladly have my hand held in that regard. Not a bomb. <laughs> That was so funny. That's a great thumbnail, too. I haven't forgotten about that, either. I'm, I'm gonna be... Oh, that's why. I need to equip my armor again. We're still pointing the right direction. Yep. So, this whole thing... I mean, we've been in... We've been in the, the depths for quite a long time now. And I'm enjoying it. Um, I want... Oh, that's a drop. You know, you know what? Am I dumb? I think I'm dumb. Yeah, I'm dumb. We're doing that from now on. That's the correct answer. I'm enjoying it because we aren't having to deal with shrines. Um, I I've talked about this a little bit, um, but not enough. And I I don't want you to feel like I'm just constantly ragging on Breath of the Wild, which is why I. I'm not constantly harping on it, um, but one thing I don't like about shrines, and I've, well, we'll break this, and I, I, I've gone on record for this one before, this is like a, a very, a very old, um, a very old take of mine, but one of the things I don't like about shrines is that, they're very... They're samey, yes. They're optional, yes. But my problem with them isn't that they exist, it's that they're the only thing that exists. The idea of mini dungeons is sweet. The idea of mini dungeons and only mini dungeons, it loses its allure for me. Because one of the things I like about... Well, honestly, one of the things anyone likes about any video game is... Uh, seeing different parts, re-experiencing parts of that game, or changes of pace, uh, different music, different atmospheres being tackled, and when shrines are the only atmosphere in the game, then... Ooh, I walked into this. I walked into this! And I have low health. Um... Be very careful. I could easily die here. Whoa! Animation cancel. That's why we do it. That's why we do it. Whew. Uh, bombs. I missed. <laughs> Flurry rush you. <laughs> Okay, attack me. You have a shield. Oh. Wait, can I do this? No, I can't. Where's the one... Not quick charge. Ah, there we go. That's what I wanted. Uh... <laughs> what was that? Other Zelda games have massively different atmospheres throughout, uh, throughout them. And looking forward to those- yes, finally I have a shield. I- I look forward to those atmospheres, and when you have Breath of the Wild, which really only has, I mean, one dungeon aesthetic. I'm not gonna pretend like it only has one aesthetic period, because that's just wrong. Um, when it has one dungeon aesthetic, it's a little bit- things feel samey, and the fact that there are the the compendium of enemies is the smallest it's ever been doesn't help with that. Where's this last enemy? Oh, you? Okay. I don't care about you. Man, okay. We're gonna have to grab that too. And... So with the with the depths, we have a lot more variety. Or well, it's it's a departure from Breath of the Wild, and it's refreshing to me that we're not having to constantly deal with shrines. Whew. 
Whew. I'm going west, I guess. I mean, I'm I'm invested now in the goddess statues and the goddess statues alone, and they're taking me west. Hero's Path mode is going to be kind of surreal later. Uh, it doesn't seem to be here yet, but we're... <laughs> we're deep in Gerudo. <laughs> and it's still going, but we're reaching the end of it, right? Certainly, and it makes sense for it to be going to Gerudo. Because that's where the goddess statues were. So, I, I guess our first area might end up being Gerudo, unless I want to make a giant... Oh, wait, where's the... Where's the goddess statue? Oh, I'm right next to it. Oh, okay. I'm blind and apparently very forgetful. Gerudo might end up being our first area. Which I'm fine with. That's organic. It's d d certainly unique. I didn't. I had a set idea of where I wanted to go, and that uh, that idea is being. Oh, you know what? And that idea is being challenged. What is that? Another hot air balloon? Mushroom. But it's one of the evil mushrooms that seems to accompany Yiga. Ah, uh, these guys. Uh. Do I have wooden weapons? I kinda do, but I really don't. I was very tempted to trade an eyeball for an eyeball, but... Come on. Yep, fly straight towards me. Don't dodge. Hey, at least they drop good stuff. Ooh, big post souls and some ruins! Ugh. Ow! That... It was very stupid of me. I can't believe I got a flurry rush at that angle. You too. Nice rock. I hit the rock, wow. Is that a pot? Please tell me that's a pot. Nope, springboard. Is that a root? Yes. Where are they? Hi, guys. You know what? Yeah. Will this distract you? Nope. Hey. Does not distract you. Because you are dumb. Your stupid little uh. monkey noises. You know, honestly, uh, the Gerudo uh, region is one of the places I'm most excited about. Because, honestly, there was the least there. It was really just, it was flat, and that's it. So, if they're really invent reinventing uh -oh, all these areas, then certainly that one's going to get a huge facelift. Hi. Ooh, hold the phone. Let's do one of these. Go! Go! Perfect. And your friend as well. Go! Oh, missed. They can miss. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm running out of bows, although I'm probably just going to get two here. Uh, I need a keys eyeball, zone eye attack power type, uh, type. Sure, let's see what this does. Oh, it is fire. Boing! That works. That was that was the app for that. Cool. But it didn't it didn't unlock. It didn't unlock the thing. So I need to be really careful here. Someone flat. That was weird. Oh! You're alive. Hi. What are you gonna do for me? Authorizer 
verified. Welcome. This was once a busy refinery where a great deal of zone light was possessed. It is all but abandoned now. I do still have associates here who process ore and manage schema stones. You should speak to them. Oh. Well, I guess this is where we get our schematics processed. Uh, but before, uh, no, we'll, let's let's stay in this lane. Authorizer verified. Welcome. This was once a busy refinery where a great deal of zone night was processed. I have something for you, but I do not think you are ready to receive it. Please visit the Great Abandoned Central Mine and return here afterwards. Great Abandoned Central Mine. We did visit that, but we missed something? Is that what I'm to understand? I guess we missed something there. I might just go out, go about and complete that quest. Huh. I'm hungry. All this turnover has led to supply shortage in the bases. Do you know how hard it is to find a banana? The depths are a complete wasteland. Nothing around here seems in the least bit edible. You'd think that everyone would take that seriously and respect the ingredient and food stock, but no. That wretched new recruit ate a whole shipment of bananas the moment I took my eyes off them. From now on, I'm keeping my own supply. Glory to Master Koga. May his jowls be ever cleaned by the Yiga younglings. Okay, so there's something, there's something over there. I don't really care about that yet. I really want to go to the top of this. And probably fight a boss. Oh. That's not what I expected. I kind of expected to see a boss. Let's... Let's do a little bit of backtracking here. We were told... We were told to go to the central refinery. We've been there before, but clearly we missed something. So I think... I should briefly return after going to the top of this, because... I mean, look at this thing. I, I think I should briefly return, or, uh, return there, and, and just to see if... I truly miss something. What did I miss? Unless, of course, he's what they're talking about. But I don't think he would be. That's what I'm missing. I didn't go up. The comments are probably, probably were pointing that out. Really? Wait, are you guys proper researchers? You guys usually don't travel in twos. Oh, I didn't think we'd see anybody down here. Though I imagine you say the same to us, huh? Huh, you're uh, here to investigate too. Uh, you know, since you took the ye I mean, uh, the survey team in I interview, because we're, we definitely took that interview too. That's why we're here. Yep. <laughs> Uh, uh, take a look at this. Our latest discovery nearly knocked us off our feet. <laughs> we found this weird device with this wavering green letter on it and this strange statue. Uh, we think it's one of those living stone constructs. Pretty sure it's supposed to move to... Well, I say that, but it is pretty much just conjecture on my part. Aww. Truth is, we're in a bit of a panic here. If we don't figure out soon how this thing works, we're going to be in some big trouble. <sighs> Oh, did you pass the interview too? You obviously did. Why else would he come strolling into a place like this? <sighs> Why'd I even bring oh? it up? 
Uh, just, just forget it. It's not important. What is important is this text we're investigating. It's fascinating. It, it claims that this stone statue could be able to act, grant us an ancient power. <sighs> That's right. Uh, this particular peculiar stone statue is nothing less than one of the fabled uh, constructs. In fact, I, I have some writing here that explains the so-called ancient power in detail. It reads, uh, The ability to will allow you to commit any structure you create to... Yes! Any object committed to memory can be instantly uh, reproduced. <sighs> Uh, just think of it. If if we could instantly recreate anything we'd ever made, uh, the ye I mean, uh, the survey team's uh, investigation of this land would be swift and unstoppable. The text further claims that this construct should be able to grant us that power. Uh, we just have to wake it up. This is gonna be weird. No reaction? Oh. Authorizer verified. It, 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 it's moving! Conferring auto build to authorizer now. Please utilize it as you explore and excavate the depths for Zonite. Oh. Oh ho ho! We have the power of th three hands now. Auto build, a new ability. Instantly recreate your ultra hand projects using nearby items in Zonite. Auto build records your previous creations. That fixes my problem. And just like I said, I was missing something. That's why I don't immediately complain whenever I see something that I don't like. That's why it took so long in the Breath of the Wild LP for me to voice any of my problems with the game. Because I was like, those problems might just be opportunities for the game to reward me. Did uh, I see what I think I saw? Did that thing just give you the power we've been researching? <gasps> That's incredible! Could you give us a demonstration? Let me see what the text has to say. Hold on, um... This ability will allow you to commit any structure you create to memory. Any object committed to memory can be instantly reproduced. Ah. I know just what to use it on. As luck would have it, both of our vehicles just broke, and we've been struggling to put them back together again. Oh. The one on the ground, the round pedestal lost a wheel, uh. and the one on the square pe pedestal has fallen to pieces. But I think if you put the wheel back onto the first one, you should be able to use your power to repair the second in no time <laughs> flat. So come on, let's see it in action. Fix them up quick. You can start by repairing the one on the round pedestal. Okay. Auto build. Whoa. Um, so, first... First, if I build this, do I remember it? Uh, not... <laughs> Wow, look at that. The wheel's right back on there, snug as a bug. And <laughs> three, like, eight inches higher. Now it's time for the main event. The one in pieces on the square pedestal. Use the new power of yours and fix it up lickety-split. Things you build are stored in auto builds history and can be easily recreated from there. I'm trying to fix it. I'm trying to do it right. <sighs> they just want it quick and dirty. All right, they just want it quick and dirty. Now, I can auto-build. Oh, my word, it's jagged. <laughs> uh, yeah! Oh, my word. Thank you, game! Whoa, it's like I'm seeing double, and you kind of messed it up there. Uh, is that fine? Built in less, less than in no time flat. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Thank you, ancient power, which I don't have. The techs were right after all. I'll say that power's incredible. Oh, master! <laughs> I don't remember my voice for him. Huh. Well, look at that. The legends were true. <laughs> Great work, both of you. You too, stranger. Credit where credit is due. Yes, credit where credit is. 
If there's one foe I'll never forget, it's the man who cast me from my Gerudo Desert hideout into these very depths. It was you! Now I live for vengeance, both upon that no-good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy. That means you, Link. We meet again at last. And don't try to tell me you've forgotten me. We are bound by fate, you and I. Hear my name and tremble in fear. I am the leader of the Yika clan. The strong, the death-defying, from the ashes rising. Master Koga. I saw it all. I saw the moment you obtained the ancient power we've sought for so long. The highlight of all the musty old texts we found in this land. It remembers objects you've assembled and can instantly reproduce them. A long lost ability from the distant past. So you... You... You're cheating! Here we are working ourselves to the bone to build things by hand. And you can just whip them up in an instant? That's not fair! You know who could have used that power? The one we worship and revere. The Magnificent One! If we offered it to him, he would have crushed you and Zelda both. But you just walked right up and snatched it away. Now I'm going to snatch it back! Uh-oh. Prepare yourself! It seems like to me... You have the power. Oh, boy. Do I have... I have more shields. Sweet. Oh, it's this again. I don't... Ooh, wait, 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 wait. I don't have stasis. I do have that. Um, okay. Kind of worked. How do I want to deal with this? I don't have the time bomb anymore, unfortunately. That would probably be really useful. Oh, I do. I died. Perfect. Let me get out of range first. He doesn't have the best turning skills. I still have a speed boost. Ugh. Still not range. Okay, there, 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 there. Perfect. Boom. Take down, come on. Perfect. That works? Question mark? Come on, get a... Uh, by Fuse attack power. Boom. Curve over him, hit him. Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna shield surf over there. I can just climb. Come on. I could spin attack there, but you know. Whoa! Get ready to do it again. Not a difficult fight. Especially when I'm equipped with key sideballs. Oh, unless he switches it up. Which he did. New phase. Honestly, is this phase any different from the last? I don't see a difference. I do, however, uh, would like to um, get naked real quick and then do that. This should deal with the phase. Didn't quite kill him. Oh, that's really nice and all, but. Whoa, that's fast! That's fast! That's really fast! Oh, but it really doesn't matter. Um. Die? Yeah. Die. Ugh, you pesky little pest. Why won't you stand still and let me squish you? Well, fine. I suppose I can let you off easy for today. You think you're so smart? 
but I've already formed a whole bunch of ru- I uh, found a whole bunch of ruins down here. Mm. I saw your little trick there. You used your right hand to get that construct going. I'll grab that power you cheated me out, f out of for myself. Off the southwestern abandoned mine. <laughs> then the Magnificent One and I will, gu will guide this world to its miserable end. And there's nothing you can do to stop us. <laughs> so don't follow me! So you're gonna crash? Okay, he's fine. I'm not gonna follow you. You're gonna follow me.